today lecture i'm going to find the value of k so k value we need to find that and if the sum of zeros of the quadratic polynomial is now 1 so this is the polynomial that is given so let's see the answer so first here writing fx equal to k x square minus 3x plus 5 so let fx equal to this one after that the next is if sum of the zeros so let first zero is now is alpha here this is alpha and second zero beta you can also assume a or b so first zero is now alpha and the second zero is beta after that here sum of zeros according to questions according to question sum of zeros sum of zeros is 1 so sum of zeros of quadratic polynomial is 1 so sum of zero is now so that here alpha plus beta is now the value is 1 and we know here alpha plus beta that is minus b by a so here the coefficient minus coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x square so that here we can write alpha plus beta is now the value come so here minus b by a so here we can write minus coefficient of x divided by coefficient x square equal to 1 so what exactly the coefficient of uh, x so coefficient of x is now so minus here coefficient of x is now minus 3 then after coefficient of x square is now k equal to 1 and after that to here this we can write minus into minus that is changed to plus and here k equal to 1 or we can write cross multiplication then 3 equal to k or we can write k equal to 3 so this is the answer of this and this is the value of k so one time going to repeat this all so here write the given polynomial then you need to assume so let first 0 is alpha and the second 0 is beta after that according to question so sum of zeros so sum of zero is now one that is given okay so the next is alpha plus beta that is one and alpha plus beta value is now coefficient of x minus coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x square or we can write minus b by a so if you know already the general formula of the quadratic equation ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0 this is the general form of the quadratic equation and this is now given polynomial 3x plus 5 so here you can easily get here the value of a b and c so here a value is now k b value minus 3 and c value is now 5 so after that or you can write here minus coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x square put the values of x then you can get here k value so this is the way we can find the value of k of this polynomial so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you